Good morning students. Today we will start chapter 1 and the name of the chapter is Introduction to Computer. And in this chapter we will learn the various characteristics of a computer system. Children, before understanding the characteristics of a computer system, let's first understand the meaning of this word characteristics. The meaning of this word characteristics is the quality any object that possesses and which makes one object different from any other object. Suppose we will talk about a human being. The characteristics of the human being will be its height, its color and its weight. These are the characteristics of a human being. And these characteristics of a particular human being makes him different from any other human being. Did you understand the meaning of characteristics children? Now think what could be the characteristics of your computer system. What could be the characteristics, uh, characteristics of your television and what could be the characteristics of your laptop? This you think yourself. Okay, let's start the first characteristics of the computer system which is speed. Okay children, this speed means it is the time taken by the computer system to solve any complex task. So, you all are working with computers, yes or no? Yes. So, have you ever seen computer system takes more time to solve any of the complex multiplication or additions? I don't think so. The computer does not take more time to solve any complex task. This is the speed characteristics of a computer system and it process millions of instructions per second. This is uh, also known as MIPS. Did you understand children what is the speed characteristics of a computer system? Okay. Now proceed to the second one. The second one is your accuracy. Okay. Before understanding uh, these characteristics, first let's understand the meaning of this word accuracy. Accuracy means the correctness. Understood children? Okay. Whenever we are working with a computer, have you ever seen the computer gives you the wrong result? No. Always the computer gives you the correct result. Okay, these characteristics of this computer is known as its accuracy characteristics. Now we can say a computer system always gives us the correct result till our input data and instructions are correct. Did you understand children the second point accuracy? Okay, now proceed to the Third characteristics. This is the last memory. It's last memory. Children, do you know what is uh, memory? Last, you might have uh, known this meaning of this word last. But what is the uh, meaning of this memory? Do you know? This is not the human's memory. This is the computer's memory. The computer's memory is one electronic space where your data and information are stored and they can be retrieved as and when you need this. Okay children, all these computers are having very large memory. Nowadays, uh, your hard disk in the market, you can get the hard disk of 2TB and uh, 1TB like this hard disk you can get. Uh, did you understand what is the last memory? A computer can store what? Too much data and information comparing to the human memory. And the memory can be stretched. The memory can be expanded. Did you understand children the hard characteristics? Okay. 
Now proceed to the fourth characteristics of this computer system. It is diligence. Children, what is the meaning of this diligence? Do you know? Diligence means to work for a long period of time without getting bored or tired. Now this computer system can work for hours without getting tired or bored. Yes or no? Have you ever seen that this computer system ask you to give I need some rest because I have been working since 7 or 8 hours. Have you ever uh, listened a such type of words from your computer? I don't think so because the computer has this diligence characteristics which helps it to work for a long period of time without getting tired or bored and it also maintains accuracy level as well this is your diligence characteristics now after this diligence what comes now it comes the versatility The fifth, the fifth characteristics of this computer system is versatility. Children, do you know the meaning of this uh, word versatility? The meaning of this versatility means uh, is to perform various tasks. That means the machine which is capable to do to perform various tasks. That is said as a versatile machine. Thus, since our computer system is capable to perform various tasks together, that is why we can say it is a versatile machine and the characteristics is versatility. Now, let's understand this how our computer system is able to perform various tasks. Children, whenever we work with the computer, we can that time, that particular time also, we can listen to music, yes or no? The simultaneously, at the same time, since we are able to perform two or three different tasks through this machine, that is why it is called a versatile machine. Now, children, these five characteristics are clear to you now. Okay. The, in the next class, we will discuss about the limitations of a computer system. Thank you.